jealous. Hey, uh, welcome back to the show. I, I sing everything like share. Oh, jealous. Hey, uh. It can become something really ugly when we're talking about jealousy in a relationship. When your insecurities flare up, your boundaries get tested. Mm -hmm. So how should you handle a jealous partner? Sex and marriage therapist Leslie Gustafson is here with her advice. Hello. 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 This jealousy. Is fairly jealousy. common, isn't it? Um, fairly common. Let's not talk about what jealousy is. It's the fear. It's the feeling we have when we fear losing love, losing our loved one to another. Yes. Okay. But that can be real fear or imagined fear. Yes. And it gets into dangerous territory when it's imagined fear. Because then you when start you're creating stuff. When you're perceiving it all over the place, you're insecure, you have abandonment issues, you have maybe low self-esteem, and you worry when your guy or gal is out there in the world. Mm -hmm. Makes you uncomfortable. You're not sure about them. You don't do separation well. You don't let them be an individual very well. Yes. Okay, so that can be made up. Something might not be happening at all that's fearful. It's that's, your own insecurities. It's your own insecurities. Yeah. So if you're the partner of someone who's jealous mm -hmm. and you've reassured them, look, I'm not interested in anybody else. Mm -hmm. I love you. I'm not doing anything weird. How do you get them to acknowledge it's their baggage at work? It's not that you're yes. A if bad it were guy. that simple, that would be we could do that. We'd just say stop it, right? Yeah, right. But oftentimes there's a little something going on on the other partner. Mm -hmm. Okay, what, the worst case scenario and the scenario I see a lot in my practice is somebody is insecure and somebody's boundaries are a little loose. Okay, okay. So then you have the combination. He's out there, she's out there, giving a little bit too much of their best self to uh, other people. Yeah. Right? Right? Okay. They're really on. They're lovely with other people. They come home and it's like, where'd that guy, where'd that gal go? Mm -hmm. So sometimes there's some boundarylessness that's happening because they're wanting affirmation or attention. Got it. Okay, so, so they are, in fact, giving love or trying to get love outside of their partner. So then you've got them both going together. How on and earth do you unravel it? You, exactly. You have to unravel it. You have to do it by um, naming it. Whose is whose? Okay. Who's doing the accusing? out of not real, who is a little too loose with their boundaries, own your own part. I know, Take but the, responsibility the last thing for your peace. The last thing somebody wants to hear is you're insecure. Right. It's, it's yeah. a button. Yeah, you can't you can't point the fingers. You got you know can't blame. You do get into the blame game. You can't do that. You have to look at your own part. And the goal is to have this awesome marriage, right? And so you know both need to be jealousy proofing your marriage by protecting it. How are you contributing to keeping the love alive in the marriage and putting your best best self into the marriage? Sure. If you're overly fearful, you need to start taking some stock around that and saying, okay, and own it. I I need to own it. I need to take care of that. Work on my own peace and not be on him or her accusing all the time Makes in sense. its extreme it can get pathological and controlling behavior starts being attached oh to that right we could talk all day we I could. love when you, I love I love when you come topic. on because this is something a lot of couples <laughs> deal with so here's the thing we want to continue the conversation uh, and you can with Leslie on her Facebook page mm -hmm. and what is your Facebook page authentic and true authentic <laughs> and true she'll answer your comments you can talk to her a lot more and you'll be back on our show again soon I hope I will thank you Bye. Leslie. thank you Leslie